Hey guys, welcome into the Metaverse on Crypto TV Plus. In today's video, we're going to be taking a portal into the Reveland Metaverse. Let's do this! Developed by Chainx Games, Reveland is a blockchain-based multiplayer online battle arena MOBA game where players can gather friends to form a team, fight with others, and earn token rewards for their individual skills or team collaboration. Reveland's gameplay is designed to combine players' individual skills and teamwork to challenge themselves in a variety of game modes with attractive ranking rewards updated within a period. Reveland is a product that truly integrates all the advantages of traditional mobile games with a high degree of completion and entertainment to create a true social gaming experience and profit model. The team at Reveland aims to create an open chain game aggregation platform that connects games, gamers, guilds, and the entire GameFi community. As I said earlier in this video, Reveland is developed by Chainx Games, a London-based metaverse game development company focusing on video gaming and blockchain development. To keep up with the pace of Chainx game development, the team brings to Reveland players a brand new and immersive play-to-earn game experience through the most popular game fight types currently in use. As a professional team aiming to create a new crypto game world, Reveland also collaborated with some of the mainstream game companies in the traditional gaming industry such as Seagem, Iceburger, which are made up of experts and talent from multiple industries, including B2B or B2C gaming services, business planning, game production, game publishing, and more. They are also in collaboration with Callis Pay, a tier one professional payment services company, Enathon, and then Smart Guild, a gaming guild dedicated to ecosystem driven GameFi education in Africa. Now let's take a look at the features of the Reveland Metaverse. The Reveland Metaverse features a multiplayer gameplay where players will have the opportunity to use their Reveland NFTs or tokens in the game to earn multiple rewards. There are six types of gameplay modes in Reveland, namely Fruit Bash, a 3 vs 3 match where you grab holy fruits at the middle of the map or defeat your opponents to snatch theirs. Gather 10 holy fruits and guard them for 15 seconds to win the match. Guard time will be reduced to 10 seconds after 2 minutes. Battle Square 10 player battle royale solo against 9 other players. Here you can defeat a player or destroy a dragon egg to obtain HP and DMG boost. Map tiles collapse over time so stay away from quaking tiles and survive until the end to win. Bounty Hunter 6 player battle royale play solo against 5 other players. Defeat a player to obtain their bounty or collect the bounty that spawns in the middle of the arena. The player with the highest bounty at the end of the match wins. Doodle Dash A 3 vs 3 match where you can work together with your teammates to cover as much ground as you can. Here you can defeat enemies to steal their tiles. The team that occupies the most tiles when the timer runs out wins the match. Alter Assault is a 3 vs 3 match where you can capture the middle altar to deal damage to your enemy's base. Destroy their base to win the battle. The altar's ATK doubles after 2 minutes. Respawn is disabled and the altar's ATK is tripled after 3 minutes. And then you have Clock Tower. A 3 vs 3 match where you team up and lead your toy troops to destroy your enemy's base. Collect the asteroids to raise your troops level. Defeat the Clock Golem to gain control over it then send it to crush your enemy's base. Reveland has also created a user-friendly experience aimed at minimizing button delay, latency, and lag. Emphasis on the lag part, because I know how it can be when a game you're having so much fun with becomes really slow. Ugh. Another feature of Reveland is the different types and amounts of really cool animal heroes. These heroes can move from level to level, processing upgraded features at each new level. Next feature is the bounty battles. By utilizing the power and advantage of NFTs, players will have authentic assets and ownership to their in-game assets which live forever in the blockchain. There are different game modes for bounty matches in the Reveland, and the number of bounty matches for each hero is different, depending on the rarity of the hero. Speaking of rarity of heroes, the rarity of heroes could change from common, rare to epic. Now here's a bonus tip for you. For each bounty battle, all acquired NFT hero gets land token rewards either in solo, team and other game modes. And then, rewards will be distributed to players who are able to secure a seat in the rankings. The higher the rank, the more valuable and generous the rewards become. The rankings are as follows. Bronze, Silver, Gold, Diamond, Heavenly, Master and Champion, which is currently the highest rank. The rubber token is created for governance and utility. It is supported by Binance Smart Chain contract. Revo can be used for the following. Staking, 
purchasing NFTs and mystery boxes, providing rewards, mode of payment within the Revelant ecosystem, providing liquidity, providing economic incentives. Another token available in the Revelant ecosystem is the land token, which can be earned by simply playing the game. Once earned, the land tokens can be slipped into your wallet. The land token can either be claimed, earned, or utilized for in-game features. Revelant aims to become the world leading in GameFi aggregation services, building a suite of comprehensive features across the Web3 ecosystem, streamlining existing industry processes to optimize user experience and empowering both players and games. Feel free to share your thoughts about Revelant in the comment section. And if you have questions about this project, also leave them in the comment section below. And also, for more information on this project, visit our website CryptoTVPlus.com and if you enjoyed this video, hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more engaging content from CryptoTV Plus. That's all for now, until next time, bye!